Hi guys, this is gonna be past calls binomial expansion. Let's start. This is our problem. X minus uh, three by six degree. X minus three six degree. And so start by. And we're gonna have three zero. The number is gonna go um, in decreasing order. Six. So we got six minus six. So we get. Um, I'm, I'm sorry. This is six. We get zero. We're gonna get zero right here. Um, You'll see. Now, because this is minus, we're gonna have minus right here. We're gonna be alternating. So, you gotta imagine that um, you raise minus one by the let's, fifth degree. So, it's fifth. So, that's why we get minus here. Um, but after this, I don't even write this one. I just write alternating um, minus and plus. Um, so now we have three one degree right here because the next is these are gonna decrease this are gonna increase and then we're gonna have factor factorial rule right here because the degree is six so on the first one we had zero and then six minus six of this and so this goes here and we subtract this right here okay next we have 6 divided by 1 because this is 1 factorial and then we have 6 minus 5 factorial right here next is gonna be plus because minus 1 fourth degree is plus and we're gonna have x plus and we're gonna have three second degree and then we're gonna have six factorial two and six minus two factorial then we're gonna have minus because the third degree i don't even like i mentioned i don't even write this one i'm just gonna emit it and we write three x third degree and three third degree and six factorial three goes here then six minus three factorial plus we have next x fourth degree so basically when you have uh, uneven numbers you minus here when you have even numbers when you have odd numbers you have minus this is plus now and then we have three second degree six factorial we got um, six minus four and we have two right here wait a second no we got four right here and yeah and this is correct and now we okay so we continue right here this is minus neck now x5 sorry it's it's not really focusing my camera x5 3 uh, fifth degree i'm sorry this was actually fourth degree that's what i messed up but anyhow this is good uh, fifth degree and then six factorial is five degree six minus Wait, uh, six, five, four, three. Oh, this was supposed to be two right here. Two. This is one. Okay, we're good now. Minus three, minus five factorial, and plus it's zero. Uh, three, six, and then we get right here. Six and then six minus 
fix and this is gonna be all zero so okay now let's move on that's how I like to do it okay so the first one now we get x6 times 1 because 0 is 1 right here and then we get um, this is this is 1 and this is 1 we get 0 basically right here and now this was supposed to be 0 right here so we got 1 right here 2 times 1 and minus it's 5 times 3 times let's see now what I like to do I like to rewrite you know I don't like to omit stuff so a 1 and we get 1 right here so uh, we got 1 right here oh my goodness I'm sorry I've been studying for 5 hours now so I'm getting a little clumsy but forgive me that uh, we get a 5 right here by 5 factorial so 6 times 5 okay. so we get 6 right here okay now we got this moving on on to this one plus x4 uh, 3 and second degree is gonna be 9 times 6 factorial then we got 2 factorial minus oh, I mean 4 factorial so let's see time 5 times 4 factorial this is right there now we this is 3 times 5 this is we gonna get 15 right here okay don't lose this number so let's move it on to this one now. This one we had minus um, x3 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 times 27 times factorial this we're gonna have 3 times 2 and then this is 3 factorial you see so okay so here we have uh, this is 3 times 2 you know 3 factorial and then this 6 minus 3 you get 3 factorial so what I'm gonna do this is 5 and all the 3 factorial this is gonna be eliminated and then um, we gonna eliminate 6 right here this is 20 okay now moving on oh, my camera is not focusing sorry about that guys moving on right here plus plus we have x2 now we're gonna have 3 raised by 4 Tell me how much is it? 3 raised by 4. Uh, I think that's. Um, oh my god, I got stuck. That's 81. 3 raised by 4. And then we have right here, we have 4 and 2 factorial. So we gotta go. 5 times 4 and this emits in this we've got 3's right here we got 15 okay you will have to multiply this don't forget but we are moving on now just finish this now the next is this minus x1 a 3 fifth degree uh, is gonna be 243 okay and now we see our factorial is gonna be 6 factorial 
five factorial and one factorial so we're gonna five we're gonna eliminate this we're gonna have to multiply 43 by 6 but later okay the last now we get x by 0 we get 1 this is 1 times 3 6 degree uh, 3 6 degree is 7 2 9 and um, this is gonna be uh, 1 because this is 0 and this is 6 factorial and divide 6 factorial this is 1 okay now what we gotta do we gotta last step multiply these things we found here so the first is okay let's write right here first one is x6 minus x5 times 3 3 times 6 18 sorry about being clumsy this is my I just learned this today so uh, x5 18 okay now the next one you got right here plus x4 and we found uh, when we calculated our factorial that we got 15 here 15 times 9 is uh, 135 135 minus we got x3 a 27 times 20 minus 540 and we got this one now plus this one x 281 times 15 uh, 1 uh, 1 2 1 5 then I won 243 times 6 we get 1 4 5 8 one, and then the last oh no not the uh, yeah the last member is right here we get 729 plus 729. Dream. That's our answer right here. I'll be in front of you. Okay. So, oh my goodness, what is going on? Okay, here we have 86 minus 5, x5, 18 plus 4, blah, 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 da, 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 da. And here we calculate, we expanded this right here using Pascal's rule and if you don't know what the Pascal's rule is this is in college algebra right here um, we got the binomial expansion but yeah I hope you enjoyed this problem please subscribe for more let me know if you have any questions. Here we have right here one more example. I thought I'll throw this in. I did it, this one real quick. They start to go real quick once you get a handle of it. But this we had x4 plus uh, e5 and you see this. So what we're gonna do the first you see 6 and then 5. And don't forget to keep this 4 on every member. But then these go decreasing order for three, two, one, one, and zero. And then we have right here is gonna be increasing order. So five, then one, then two, then three. And then we're gonna have our factorial six, and you subtract this number that is increasing. Six minus two is four. 2 right here and then 6 minus 3 3 and then we got get this beautiful answer right here it's 24 plus 6 well 
and uh, yeah, this one took me real quick, maybe one, I don't know how many minutes, but much quicker than this one, but yeah, these are pretty easy, so have fun everybody.